So Jason, do you see a, a time, and this has been a very controversial topic that's been spoken of le recently, that somehow we would tag green coin versus non-green coin, that there would be two asset classes within Bitcoin. Do not shoot the messenger. I, I think an important property that makes Bitcoin valuable is that it's fungible. And one Bitcoin is always one Bitcoin, no matter, no matter where it comes from. So, back to you, Frank. When an institution says, look, I'm going to do a, a waiting, I want to buy a billion dollars worth of coin, and it has to be check the box with my sustainability committee, even though we know that this is an unusual dialogue to be having, but it's got to be dealt with. How do you solve it? I'm sorry, Kevin, I cannot. Your question is? It's this. I need a sustainable coin. Yes. A sustainable asset. I have to get compliance to agree to buy it. How, you, how do you deliver that to me as a miner? An asset, a coin, a specific piece of property. Well, what we, what we do is we, as, as Hive does, is that we mine these virgin coins. They're untainted. They've not been anywhere as bad. They're, and we hold all of them. Uh, and we just continue and we mine Ethereum Classic, sell that, they'll pay the electrical bills and keep hodling. Uh, and so we think, and, and we think that our coins are more valuable because they've been untainted and they've only come from green energy and they should have a two-tier price system and our coins should be more valuable. That's what I personally think.